dog flu is and what to do about it. Paul. Phil will start out by saying that there is not a single case of dog flu jumping to humans. But scientists say it mutated and jumped species once already from horses to dogs, and enough cases are popping up around the country to warrant a new vaccine. Come on, Jake, let's go home. Steve Sherrill of Renexa takes good care of Jake, his eight-month-old German Shepherd, and news of a dog flu stunned him. Never heard of it. Now, and I, you know, we've been to our vet on a regular basis. The Centers for Disease Control started tracking dog flu five years ago when it turned up in greyhounds. It came from horses originally. And like a greyhound, this flu could travel fast. According to the New York Times, cases have turned up in Florida, New York, Philadelphia, and Denver. So far, vets around here don't think they've seen the dog flu, but admit it's tough to tell. About 10 to 20 percent of dogs can be walking around with the virus with no clinical signs, meaning that they um, are infected with it. They're likely shedding the virus into the environment, but they look like a normal, happy, healthy pet. He says 95 percent of dogs who get the virus will get better, but 5 percent can get really ill and could die. Dr. Lucas says dogs with smushed faces have a harder time dealing with the flu. They're born from the get-go with the respiratory uh, uh, anatomic respiratory abnormality. The U.S. Department of Agriculture just approved a vaccination for the dog flu, but here at the Veterinary Specialty and Emergency Center in Overland Park, they're not recommending it yet. If cases do start to pop up, Dr. Lucas says that would change. As Jake finishes playtime at Shawnee Mission Park, his owner, Steve Sherrill, now has something entirely new to think about. I'll definitely talk to our vet the next time we're there and, and see if there's something we need to uh, do with, with him. Stand by. Dr. Lucas says dog flu should not give you a reason to keep your dog from daycare or kennels, but if yours spends a lot of time in those places and does get sick, he says you ought to ask the people who run those agencies if they're seeing a lot of dogs with the same problems. You can also head to fox4kc.com under the Scene on TV section where we have links to the New York Times story and to the CDC where you can find out a lot more information. Paul Hurtner, Fox 4 News.